My book and ticket drawing. But I'm angry, yeah, I'm looking at my book and ticket. Excuse uh -huh. me. In September, I told my parents I had put in my two weeks and had already booked a trip to Japan. In today's video diaries, I pack for that trip, eat delicious meals, run errands, and enjoy a nice weekend at home. Hope you enjoy. Just woke up. I feel super sweaty and groggy and inflamed. Perks of working night shift. I love it. On this night, I had just finished working four shifts in a row and decided to treat myself to some Italian food. And let me tell you guys, four days in a row is really any minute now. I'm gonna go pick up my dinner at Carrabba's. I've never tried their food before so I'm excited. I'm pretty sure it's better than Olive Garden, right? There's no love more sincere than the love of food. Yes, period. Truffle fries. What is this? Oh, this is the tiramisu. Some house salad with pepperoncini. Peppers, I love those. Banana peppers. Pepperoncini, I'm not sure. This is mine. Yum. It's giving frozen dinner, but okay. This is what I got from my parents. This is the linguine seafood. Ooh, with mussels. Ravioli. Ravioli. First bite of the shrimp scampi with the toast. So well seasoned, and the toast is like garlicky and buttery. Mm. Truffle fries. I thought it was the white stuff, but my sister said it's Parmesan. So I'm not sure what truffle is, but I just toasted everything again. Even better than the restaurant. Oh, yeah. Let's try that. Yeah, the butter is like super light but creamy <laughs> super rich and moist with the little chocolate shavings oh my gosh where's the spin on my life i'm gonna have to save some of this for tomorrow day and I kind of feel I don't know what the right word is but like guilty or bad about leaving I don't really know if this is the right move I just know that this job has made me into a shell of a person and I just am not happy I've just been pushing myself spreading myself thin to the very limit I just can't do it anymore <coughs> Fish cake patty, chicken patty. I always love helping my parents with cleaning around the house. Today's chore just happened to be vacuuming the couch. I'm pretty sure this is only an Alabama thing. If you ever see it, highly, highly recommend trying it. It's so good. 10 nuggets, two apple pies. Their apple pies are really good. I'm gonna share one with my sister because my mom didn't want it. Their honey mustard is the best, but they didn't have any, I guess. They didn't bother to tell me. Look at that. Like, look at this crispiness. That is scrumptiously dumptious. Mm. Y'all knew what you signed up for. Alright, I gotta see what the game plan is. Mm -hmm. 
if you're not shopping with a Walmart app or any kind of app to tell you like where the stuff is so you can go in and go boom, boom, boom and get out of there, what are you doing? Why'd you wash your hands and then touch the dirty groceries? If you couldn't believe it, during the pandemic, my mom would buy us groceries and make us like Kleenex all of the groceries before we touched them. Was that just a my mother thing? Got some raspberries, golden kiwis, salad dressing, salad. This is my first time buying a pre-made salad mix. I usually just get like the individual like lettuce bulbs, but I'm gonna be leaving on a trip soon. So this should last me a week. Cucumbers, aroma tomato, olipop drinks, got this, chips, the churro ones, this is really good. Sun chips, excited to try these. Aris wax strips for like eyebrows and like body. I use them on my armpits and they're really good, so. Salmon, this is about a pound of salmon for 16 or $17. It's expensive to be a living. Chicken sausage. I think there's like chunks of apple in here. Really good. Mmm. Mmm. Everyone knows that fiber is good for you, right? But apparently you can eat the skin of the kiwi. Don't worry, I washed it. And I just eat the skin. I'm kind of full, but I want to try this. Give me your goods. It smells like vanilla. I feel like I've had this before. They're just like honey grams. Literally says it on the package. Grams. I like it. 10 out of 10. good with kimchi or something but i don't have any this is teriyaki flavor it's not my favorite that's all we have this is the only way to open this the seaweed snack packets okay let me show you first you do a little tear here a little tear here so normally people would just open one side and then slide it out and then you know how the oil on the bottom gets out onto the table and everything if you know you know anyways so you open these two sides and then you open the middle and then you can kind of peel it down like that that way all the oil doesn't get on your table you're welcome Ta-da! that looks delicious i get a little bit of fish and rice sushi wrap okay the sliding is terrible i'm gonna eat this and enjoy youtube Okay, I've been putting this off all morning, but it's time to pack for my Japan trip. Let's do this. One outfit done. This is gonna have to start up another day because I am absolutely exhausted.
busted out the silver chopsticks for the kimchi. Perfect combination. I don't know if you can see that, but it's steaming. Mmm. This kimchi is so good. I think my mom got it from the Asian market. The steaming hot rice with the cold kimchi is so good. Okay, day two. I think I have it figured out now. Bring about seven outfits for half of the trip and then we're gonna have to do the laundry somewhere. I don't know, we'll figure it out for the rest of the trip. So 14 day trip, seven outfits-ish. This is the next outfit, I think. Cute little pink blouse. Okay, just a white t-shirt with the maxi skirt. This will be the fourth outfit. This will be the fifth outfit. Sixth outfit will be this sweater and jeans. Really simple. I don't really know what the weather is going to be like. Half zip, half open moment. <laughs> I'm bringing it. The thing about traveling alone is, as a female, like you're kind of afraid to kind of dress the way you would with your family or your friends. I'm trying to decide if I can fit all of this into one little suitcase that I have or bring a big luggage. If I bring a big luggage, I'll have to probably pay extra and I don't want to do that. And it's just a hassle to lug a bigger luggage around. So I don't know if this will fit all of that. Oh, heck no. This is not going to fit. You're definitely not going to have enough space. And how much shopping am I planning on doing? That's the question. I think like this much room could be enough for extras. I'll figure it out and I'll see you guys the next time I vlog. I made it to send so I really wish I'd gotten that on camera.